Alex Dimino versus Jack Draper is a final quarterfinal for the men's US Open for 2024. And both guys have had different roads to get to this stage. Draper into the tournament as the number 25 seed and will take on Zhong in the first round. But unfortunately, Zhong wasn't able to finish the match and retired in the third set with Draper winning 6-3, 6 love, 4 love retirement. In the second round, he take on Diaz Acosta. And again, no problem for Draper getting through in straights. 6-4, 6 2 six, two, six, two. In the third round, he take on Van der Zanschul, who had just beaten Alcaraz in one of the biggest upsets in recent history. But again, no problem for Draper getting through in straights. 6-3, 6, three, six, four, six two. In the fourth round, he take on Mahatch, who had beaten Sebastian. Sebastian Corda earlier in the tournament, but again, no problem for Draper getting through in straights. 6-3, 6, three, six, one, six two, to advance to his first quarterfinal of a slam. Dimonor into the tournament as number 10 seed, and will take on Giron in the first round. And after dropping the third set, would fight to win. 6-3, 6, three, six four, five, seven, six, four. In the second round, he'd take on the qualifier for Tannen, but this is no problem getting through in straights. 7 5 6, one, seven, six. In the third round, he'd take on Evans, who he'd never beaten before in their previous meetings. And after splitting the first two sets, Evans would get injured, allowing Dimonor to win. 6-3, six, three, six, seven, six, love, six, love. In the fourth round, he'd take on Thompson, a fellow Aussie who had taken out her catch and Anaudi along the way. But unfortunately, Thompson wasn't able to compete. And after splitting the first two sets, Dimino would run it out in the end. Six love, three, six, six, three, seven, five to advance to the quarterfinals. These guys have played three times before with Dimino winning all three matches, including a match in the semifinals of Acapulco earlier in the year where Draper unfortunately had to retire. But all the matches they've played have gone the distance or at least have gone three or four sets depending on the type of tournament or the type of event that it is. So I would be very surprised if either guy was easily able to win this match against the other. Draper's going to win this one. He needs to really serve well and use that lefty serve. We know how good it is. We've seen him, some of the best players in the world, especially Alcaraz at Queens Club, really stands out as one of his best performances of the year. He needs to do that in his first quarterfinal of a major. Remember, both these guys have not made it past this stage. Draper's here for the first time. Dimonor trying to make a semi for the first time. Great opportunity. So he needs to sort of like realize that as well so that he doesn't maybe get as nervous as maybe if he was playing someone who's a little more experienced. Dimonor's going to win this one. He really needs to win one of the first two sets, I reckon. Try and get Draper doubting himself because Draper hasn't lost a set all week. We saw last year I think he came to the fourth round without dropping a set. And then when he did drop a set, it didn't go so well. So if Demon can get that first set or the second set, maybe cause a little bit of doubt in Draper's mind, he might be able to get the win there on the psychological edge. Love this match. It's going to be really interesting to see who is up for making their first semifinal of major. But I have to go with Demon on this one in four sets. I just reckon Demon's going to be a little too consistent. And also, if they drag out the rallies, I reckon fitness wise, Demon might be a little bit better in the end than Draper. And also with the experience, Draper hasn't been in this stage. Neither has Demon but Demon has won big trophies. So I reckon that might just work out in the end, but let me know down in the comments below who's making the semis.